I found these curtains with grommets on clearance, but I do not like grommets. Here are six current curtain styles. The style chosen usually depends on the rods and finials and how they'll be incorporated into your room design. My preferred style has the hidden tabs. Okay, so we're going to get into how to change these curtains that have grommets into curtains with the hidden tabs. We can use a rotary cutter to remove the grommets or we can use a pair of scissors. I'm going to use these scissors to remove this top layer that has the grommets. Next, I'm going to cut the fabric in order to create the tabs, I'm just going to cut between each one of those pieces and cut the middle piece in half in order to create my tabs. So here I have two tabs. Okay, so now we're going to take our tabs and we're going to pin them to the hem of the curtain. So I know what you're thinking, why am I using the hem? I'm going to use the hem as a guide to ensure that when I get ready to sew the tabs, that bottom line across the hem will be my guideline for hiding the stitches for adding the tabs. So here I have my tabs and I'm going to pin them in place before I sew them down. Okay, so I go ahead and I'm sewing by hiding my stitches using that hemline. I'll stitch across the top and the bottom of the tabs and I will do this for each of the tabs that I add to both curtain panels. Okay, so I have not neglected the bottom hem of the curtains. I've actually added this gray fabric in order to incorporate both colors into the room. And here's the completed look. I have my tab back curtains instead of the curtains with vomits. <laughs> 